Now, I'm not going to describe how everything works in this sorting method, um, but if you go to this website, which will be linked in the description, um, it talks about alphabetical sorting. It has bubble sorting and exchange sorting. And we're going to use exchange sorting. So inside of their public static void sort string exchange method, just copy the contents inside of that. So copy and paste it directly into our method. And now we're going to have to change a few things. We can keep we can keep the i and j, and then change string temp into main activity dot pack temp. And instead of x dot length, type in packs dot length. And same for the second x. And then for the if xi, we'll change this to if packs i dot label because it's comparing strings and packs i uh, or packs j dot label and then change temp equals x to temp equals packs i and then packs i equals packs j and then packs j equals temp. So now we are done with sorting. Now we need to actually call that method. So go into your set packs method and on the last line type new sort apps dot exchange sort and put in packs so now when we run it you can see that it's sorted in alphabetical order so thank you for watching um, next video we are going to actually get into launching the application when you click on it so please subscribe and like and please comment.